Well, I think we have a lot of open questions in the play, and uh, you can make a lot of decisions for yourself. One of the interesting things about having power, I think, for the first time, if you feel like you've, you've been owed it and it's been denied you for a lifetime, and suddenly somebody says, here, just take it. I trust you. Do what you feel you're compelled to do. Um, I think it can be a very heady experience. And I think w one of the things that I'm always looking for in this is not to judge Angelo as a human being. I judge his actions very harshly. But as a human being, th it could be any one of us. This, this behavior, we're all capable of this behavior. But he's human with weaknesses and frailties and insecurities that are overcompensated for. It seems to me that he comes from a place of great conflict and shame about the authenticity of sexual impulse. And he's at war, uh, a war that, that I think is fairly common, uh, between the power of sexuality in, in one's essential nature and the ability to control it and focus it and steer it in a particular way. Um, I think he comes to have to evolve on that issue.